I am not prepared for this, so hopefully you guys are. What's up, everyone? Today we're going to go ahead and we're actually going to play a little bit of poker. And for those of you guys that don't really know much about the game or you don't know anything about the game, I made a video a couple of days ago titled uh, Basics to Poker, Introduction to Poker, something like that. It's uh, a couple of days ago in the videos. I strongly suggest you, t uh, you check it out really quickly and uh, that'll teach you some fundamentals about the game. Just a little bit, not that much, but enough to probably understand what's going to be going on in this video. So, also, I'm going to be doing another giveaway. Uh, because this is the first video, it's a little bit awkward and weird. We're in the same situation that we were in with the scratch card video where um, you guys didn't really expect a giveaway and I don't really have a list of people to draw from. So this is going to be, again, episode zero, right? And uh, the giveaway will start on the next episode. But if you guys want to enter, I'm going to go through it very quickly. Uh, all you have to do is just leave a comment in the info section. Um, Go ahead and thumbs up the video, give it a like, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, and also there's going to be uh, two giveaways that involve Twitter, which relate following to my Twitter account and also liking and uh, retweeting that video. So that's five different giveaways. Each one is going to give away 10% of the prize pool that I win in the next video, up to $500. So uh, it's all going to be in the description. Just take a look at that, check it out. And uh, if I win, say, $200 next video, then if all those benchmarks are reached, uh, there will be a $100 giveaway. And that is very well possible. Much more likely than with the scratch cards, actually. So let's go ahead and uh, get things started. So I don't want this to be a tremendously long video because, you know, I don't want to keep putting out one-hour videos because that's just no fun, right? Nobody wants to listen to my boring-ass voice for an hour. So we're going to go ahead and play something called jackpot poker if you're familiar with it jackpot poker uh spinning goes on poker stars and what that is is uh you play with two other people so it's played with three people and a uh, prize pool is randomly selected it's like a slot machine before you actually play poker and the randomness determines what the prize pool is it's a jackpot right uh and then you play for that prize pool and the lowest that you can uh get is twice the amount that you paid for and then the highest can go up to, I believe, 2,500 times your buy-in, the amount that you paid for. So let me go ahead and use technology to actually uh, show you guys. So here we go. Boom. There it is. All right. So this is the uh, prizes and frequency image that I took from the site that I'm going to be playing on. I'm not sponsored, so I don't have to mention their name. Uh, and as you can see, if you buy in for let's just say $10, the lowest you can win is $20, and the highest that you can win is $25,000. But the chances of that, pretty low, right? We have a 70,518 out of 100,000 chance, so 70%, to win $20 versus a 1 in 100,000 chance to win $25,000. So uh, it's pretty unlikely that we're going to hit the jackpot, but I've seen it happen before. I know people who have hit the jackpot before uh, personally, and I have hit high jackpots before, not $25,000, but I have hit, uh, you know, one, two, two, three thousand dollar jackpots before on, on different sites. Uh, something similar to this, not quite exactly the same. So it does happen, it can happen, and maybe it'll happen right now, um, but maybe it won't. Who knows? Let's go ahead and, and try it out, though, and uh, get things started. So again, I need to use technology to move to the next screen. Will it work? Again, kind of. I didn't get rid of the last image. So here we go. This is the site uh, because I play in America. I can't use uh, some of the other sites that are more popular, but this will work. You know what? This will work just fine. So let's go ahead and queue up. Let's get started. We're going to do a $10 game today because I'm not really feeling like torching $40 quite yet. If this goes all right, then we'll go ahead and uh, we'll, we'll do a $40 game later. But let's just start with $10 bucks and uh, you know see where it goes. We can still win up to twenty five dollars so let's go ahead and register. All right. And here it is. And it's not working. Fuck. All right. There it is. All right, we're playing for $20. 20 bucks. So we, we hit the absolute... Holy shit, that was loud. We hit the absolute lowest jackpot that we could. But that's okay. You know what? We could still win $20. So I am okay with this. Damn, that's still pretty loud. Uh, Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and explain how the game works. Very, very basics. Just again, the fundamentals, right? 
uh, we're playing with three people. Each person is randomly given a card. I'm going to go ahead and raise right now, and I'll explain what that is in a second. Again, if you guys haven't watched the basic introduction to poker video, or you don't know what's going on, this might be a little bit too much for you. We didn't get anything. We were playing with three people. Everyone has randomly dealt two cards. This is Texas Hold'em No Limit, right? Then you bet. You can bet, you can fold, you can check, you can raise, you can do all these actions, again, explained in the other video, and essentially you're trying to either get money out of people or get people to throw their hand away, and then you see cards, and you're trying to make poker hands. Um, no, we don't really have anything here. Poker hands are pairs, straights, flushes, straight flushes, royal flushes, all that fun stuff, again, explained in my uh, introduction video. And uh, whoever has the best hand wins. Or if your opponents fold their hands, then you win as well. What did they have? Oh, they had a six. All right. Well, we didn't have the best hand there. Uh, the ace is the best card in poker, in this game of poker, in most games of poker. Uh, so we are playing against one other person right now. The chances that they have an ace beat, pretty low, right? It's pretty hard to, to have an ace. And even though we didn't actually hit an ace, the chances of hitting an ace are really, really low. We're still going to bet because the chances that they have a 9 or a 4 are very low. Only about 15-ish percent, right? So we could we could very well have the best hand, and, and indeed we did. We took down the pot even though we didn't actually manage to make a pair or match our ace. We have another ace. Also very good. We're going to go ahead and raise. And again, I'm trying to dumb things down a little bit because I don't really know how many people know much about poker, so I'm not going to go ahead and be like, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and 3-bit this because, you know, his, you know, C-bet fold frequency is, you know, you know, 15%, so I'm going to go ahead and, you know, V-pip this, you know, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to do that because I don't know how many people uh, are aware with advanced poker knowledge, so I'm just going to go ahead and try to keep things simple, at least for the first few videos. We managed to make a four. A pair of fours. That's not bad. It's not great. He could still have a better hand, but you know what? We're only playing one other person. If, if you imagine him to have two random cards, what are the chances that he has a better hand? Very unlikely, but because he just called our bet right now, you know, there's a pretty good chance that he has his beat. So we're actually just going to probably give up at this point. And if he bets, then I'm almost positive he has a better hand than us. Yeah, it looks like he he might have a 9, he might have an 8, he might have a pair in his hand that's higher, but I don't think our ace 4 is, is very good here. So we're just going to go ahead and fold, which is unfortunate, but, you know, you have to be able to make decisions like that or you're going to you're gonna lose money, right? So again, I'm going to be giving away half of, uh, up to half of the next video's winnings. So if I won this game, if it was the next video, I would give away up to $10, right? Let's go ahead and raise. Again, all that stuff is going to be in the info section, but it's very similar to the last videos. All you have to do is like, uh, leave a comment, subscribe, and then there's two Twitter-related things. Like and uh, retweet the tweet about this video and follow the Twitter. This is a very good hand in, uh, in poker. In No Limit Hold'em, we have an ace and a king. The ace is the best possible card, and a king is the second best possible card, so we have a very good hand. Unfortunately, we did not manage to make a pair, but we still probably have the best hand. He does bet. That's very unusual. We're going to go ahead and try raising, and if he just goes all in, then, you know, he's got us beat. He's supposed to. Uh, well, he should have. Um, let's do 145. Checked to me and let me bet. So, it's a little bit weird. Yeah, it doesn't look like we have the best hand here. He bets 30 chips. Wow. <laughs> I mean, I could always hit an ace or a king, right? Let's just go ahead and see. Maybe we'll get really lucky. That is not an ace or a king. If he bets another 30, ugh, he puts me all in. Doesn't look like we're doing that great. The funny thing is, I accidentally uh, done goofed, and uh, I recorded the entire video um, just a few minutes ago where I, <laughs> I won the game in, uh, in like two minutes. But uh, this game's not going too well. Of course, now that I'm on camera... I get wrecked. Uh, queen nine. These guys both limp. I think this is good enough. You know what? We're only playing two other people. The chances of them having a, uh, a better hand, eh, it's about 50% or so. Maybe a little bit higher than that. But this is definitely not a bad spot to go all in because we are pretty short on chips. 
The chances that we're going to hit a queen or a nine, pretty low on the flop, which is the first three cards. So I think this is pretty reasonable. Yeah, there we go. We took it down. We just gained 60 chips just like that. Easy money. We have an ace. Aces are the best card. So the chances that this guy has a pair or a better ace, pretty low. So we can pretty safely go ahead and say, I'm all in. If you got a better hand than us, then... You know what? The Bob Ross gods are with you. And we have a better hand, right? And we're holding up so far. We've made a pair of uh, twos. Uh, we're good. There we go. Our pair of twos holds. So we have doubled our chips and we are back to our starting stack, which is not that bad. Five and a six. Eh, we're going to just go ahead and fold. There's no reason to play a hand like that right now. We just worked our way up from about 150 chips back up to 500. So you know what? I'll take my win right now and wait for some better hands. All right. Hopefully one of these guys can get knocked out pretty quickly and then we can play heads up. Usually a little bit more exciting. But if you're playing like a really long tournament, a really, uh, you know, deep stacked long tournament, this video could take five or six hours. So these jackpot games usually don't take more than... 10 to 15 minutes at the very most. So I feel like they're pretty good for making a video. All right. Well, we're definitely not going to raise this hand. This is one of the worst hands in the game. So there's nothing we can do in this situation besides fold. The chances that he has a better hand than 8-3 are about 99%. Jack and a deuce, also yeah. not that great of a hand. Uh, we could limp, but honestly, I'm just going to go ahead and let it go. Some of you poker pros might be like, what a nit, man. I can't believe he folded Jack Deuce. Such a good hand. It's really not. Now, what are you going to do if you hit a Jack, right? There's a, you're beat by any other Jack in the game. Ace-9, on the other hand, this is a good hand. I don't think I'm going to be folding this very often. Let's go to make it 110. I mean, just think of it this way, right? If you have a deck of cards and you deal out three hands and you have Ace-9, what are the chances that somebody has a hand better than that? Pretty, pretty low. I don't know the exact odds, but it's got to be under 20 to 30 percent. All right. Seven, eight, off suit. You know what? Let's just go ahead and try to raise this. We've been a bit aggressive, so I don't really feel like folding this, though. I mean, when you're playing three-handed, you kind of have to play a lot of hands. We have not flopped anything, but this guy doesn't know that, right? Maybe we have a king. Maybe we have the uh, ace-king again, so... You know what? Let's go in and bet. And if he calls, then we have to just shut down. There's nothing we can do about it. I think we are fucked, my friends. I think we are fucked. We actually improved to a pair of sevens. So we can go ahead and try this again. Uh, if we... Uh... God, it's really... this, is, this is not a great turn card, right? Let's go ahead and try it again. Let's do, 100 and... no, let's do 145. The problem with this, though, is we're really fucked if he puts us all in. Yep, we are we are fucked, my friends. He has definitely got a better hand than us, and I can't really see calling this. I mean, it, it, as incredible of a price I am to get, let me think about this for a second. I mean, a 7, right? He doesn't have a straight. He's probably got a king. We have to hit a 7 or an 8. We have 5 cards to hit. We're, we have to pay 145 chips to win what is going to be a 1,000. It's going to be really hard to work back from this. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just go for the gamble. This isn't a great play. Uh, never mind. I didn't click the button in time. Either way, either way, whoa, what the fuck? Either way, we were fucked in that situation. He probably had at least a nine. He might not have had a king, but he probably had at least a nine. Damn, I forgot these uh, jackpot games. You only have a 10 second time bank. And now that I think about it, I don't think it. I'm okay with the fact that it timed me out because I know I wasn't I was behind. I had to hit a miracle of five cards in order to win that hand, so you know. Yeah, either way, it's fine. If I called that, if I made the wager, if you don't know what calling is, oh we are fucked. We are fucked because we have to go all in with this hand. We cannot fold. Because if we fold we go down to a hundred chips and then to double up, we we have just barely over the amount of chips that we have. So we did a miracle, my friends. We need a miracle. We need the Bob Ross gods to go ahead and bless us right now and somehow manage to flop three eights. Here we go, guys. Let's 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 do it. Let's do it for Bob Ross. Oh, we are totally fucked. Let's see some eights. Oh, that is not a good start. We need a three or an eight. 
And that's not a three or an eight. Rip. And that's it, guys. It's all ogre now. So unfortunately, we did not win. We have managed to take $10 and just torch it just like that. Uh, which is kind of funny because I recorded this entire game, same length, about a 15-minute video. Nah, it's, it was a little less than that because I won really quickly. I recorded this entire video before and, and I won the game super fast. Uh, but then the recording got messed up. Uh, it turns out that I wasn't recording it properly, so I couldn't use the footage. So, yep, this is the one that's probably going to go up. And, of course, we got destroyed. Anyway, guys, uh, next video, there will be a giveaway. If I win the game, up to 50% of the winnings, all you got to do is go ahead and comment, thumbs up, subscribe, and then two Twitter-related uh, giveaways as well. It's five benchmarks. It's going to be 100, uh, actually, I don't know yet, so don't quote me on this, but one of them is going to be for liking the video, one of them is going to be for subscribing to the channel, one of them is going to be for video views, one of them is going to be for Twitter followers, and one of them is going to be for uh, likes and retweets on the tweet that links this video. So each one is going to be 10%, up to a total of 50% uh, of anything that I win in the next video, up to a maximum of $500. So all that stuff is going to be in the description. If you guys are interested, it'll take you two to three seconds to go ahead and enter. So sorry we didn't win this game. Uh, do we have any images or anything? Do we have an ending image here? No, I don't want to play again. Oh, that's just, that's that one. That's the scary guy again. We're not going to play poker, boys. We, we already lost. We're done for now. Anyway, thanks again, guys. Appreciate it. Have a good one, and I'll see you all very soon. Peace.